everyone. For those of you who are returning, welcome back. And for those of you who are new, welcome to my channel. My name is Kotar. Make sure you hit the subscribe button and watch to the end. Make sure you leave a comment and like the video as well. And make sure you also follow me on Instagram. Today's video, I'm pretty sure the title gives itself out already. For those of you who don't know, I am a true diehard Leo. My birthday is August 8th. It's literally right around the corner. And so today's video, we're honoring it because it is the first day of Leo season. And this look is for all my Leos. You know, it's bold, it's nice, it's warm, it's gold. It's what we love. We love to shine. We love to be amazing. Y'all already know what we Leos love to do. Anyways, so if you want to keep watching on how to get this look, then just keep watching and I'll see you guys at the end. So, as I said in my intro, and I'm pretty sure the title gives it away, it is Leo season. It's the first day of Leo season. And I thought, why not do a makeup look for Leo season? Because one, it's the um, best season and I kind of think like this should be a holiday, not just a season. But hey, that's just my opinion. And two, because hello, I'm like a true Leo. August 8th, baby, in like two weeks, we're gonna go crazy. But yes, so I thought all that, and I was like, oh my god, what happened? Wait, I just literally tried to grab my bronzer, my M439 brush, and literally just like yellow eyeshadow all over it. Oh my god, what happened? I'm gonna clean that off real quick. Give me a second. Unacceptable. Unacceptable. I'm gonna put that to the side right now. I'm gonna go in with my eyes first. So usually, you know how I always do my skin first? Today, I think I'm gonna do my eyes first because we're gonna go with a warm, like, just like a warm reddish orange look. Orange look. I don't know about y'all, but when I think of Leo's and, I mean, not only is our season towards the end of the summer, not towards the end of the summer, but basically the main highest peak of the summer, I should say. You know, we don't really own cancers. Like, ew, cancer who? Ugh. It's like, I'm just joking. I'm just joking. If any of you are cancers and you're watching my video, I got a soft spot. I kind of got a soft spot for you guys because one of my good friends, she is a cancer and I really vibe with her and I love her. But yes, anyways. About Leos, I always think about red and oranges and just like warm colors coming together and basically just like forming a look. So that's exactly what we're going to do here for Leo season. Can you tell? Like, I'm just like so excited. First of all, I'm so excited to be back on camera. I'm gonna catch you guys up on my life and where I've been, why I haven't been, why there's hasn't been a video so consistently. So we're gonna prime the eyes with the Morphe Eyelid Primer first. Okay, we are primed and ready to go. So as I was saying, well, where I've been, first of all, we're gonna start off with the Jaclyn Hill Original Palette, and we're gonna go in, I can just get it open. We're gonna start off with this eyeshadow color right here, this one right here. My nails are done because I wasn't smart. I didn't schedule an appointment to get my nails done for first day of the season, but that's okay, honey, because they will be done. Mark my words for my birthday. Of course, they'll be done. But anyways, where I've been lately. So if you can tell, and if you can't tell about my background, it's completely different. I have finally moved into my new place that I'm going to be living in for the rest of the school year, for the next year or so. I was in Towson and it's my house. This is my room. I'm still moving in. Don't worry. I'm going to give you guys a video of my whole room tour and everything. My background right now is my vanity, as you guys can tell. But not everything is laid out in my room yet. There's still a couple pieces that I need to get in and put some de decorations on my wall and everything. So be patient with me. That's what I've been doing. Also, I'm also taking a summer class. And the final is like literally coming right around the corner. I literally just took um, an exam today. Still waiting on the grades for this class, for the exam grades, but I'm also getting ready for the final, which is about a week and a half or so. 
I'm so ready for this class to be finished. It's gonna literally be finished on August 4th and I'm so ready because no classes on my birthday is literally the moves. So yeah, so that's where I've been. I've been moving, I've been studying for my class. I've been, also I've been thinking about content for my channel as well in my free spare time. So I've been thinking that I think I would allow you guys more into my life obviously so i think i'm gonna do more than just like makeup looks because i'm just like you know there's more to my life than just makeup you know there's like school there's the fact that i am a diabetic and i can let you guys in on how like i maintain my diabetes um just like a whole bunch of other things just like vlogging and all of that so i'm definitely gonna be changing the content so be ready for some you know different kind of videos being posted i also need to start man like managing my time because I'm gonna have some free time between August 3rd to August 23rd sometime around like that where I'm not gonna have classes and once classes start again you know and I work and everything I'm gonna start working I definitely need to manage my time to also make sure to manage my time for schoolwork manage my time for work and also manage my time for this for my YouTube channel as well so I'm working on it so we're still blending in with that shade just warming up the eyes a bit Right. What's next? We're gonna go in with um an orange. I'm gonna start off with an orange first, and I'm gonna go in with feeling myself from the Jaclyn Hill Volume Two palette. I can just find my brush. I'm gonna go in with um an M five seven three. I'm going to put that on the outside of the corner and I'm just going to start blending that in. But yeah, that's where I've been. It's been really busy and hectic. Just moving in and everything and settling into my new place. I'm just studying for this class. For those of you who don't know what class I'm taking, I'm taking biochemistry and it's a five week course class and it's just so stressful. So ready for it. Just so ready to pass the class and so ready for this class to be over. Because it's just like so much. It's like so time consuming. Just like studying and trying to pass and like homework and quizzes and exams. Any of you who are like chem or bio majors or just like STEM majors who have taken like biochemistry know what this class is like. It's just so stressful. But then again, I feel like even with this new school year coming up, my last semester, not in school year, but my last semester, I'm so ready to graduate, knows that like I'm even gonna have even more harder classes than I'm gonna be taking. Like I'm gonna be taking inorganic chemistry, I'm gonna be taking physical chemistry lab, and I'm gonna be taking um, two electives, forensic chemistry and toxicology chemistry so like I'm just like ugh. I hope I have time to do the things that I want to do because I'm also going to be working at Target I got a little cute little part-time job at Target ready for that too <laughs> and I'm also just ready to graduate and just like find a job relating to my major I definitely think I'm gonna definitely be going to grad school Probably fall 2021, I'll probably be going to grad school. Or maybe I'll be working. I don't know. Depends. Depends where I am. But I definitely, definitely um, got to go to grad school ASAP to finish my education and get my certification, my master's. Okay. So we put that in. We blended that all out. Definitely want to go in and blend the crease area with an E17. Blend that all in. Like that. It's so weird 
doing my makeup my brows aren't done my skin isn't done but like i just thought like i would do like a different way today i also haven't done my makeup in so long so definitely just want to take it come back and be a little different <laughs> be a little obnoxious because you know it's leo season and like where my leo is at it's time for us to be obnoxious and loud this is our time to shine. I mean, we shine 365 days of the year, but like this is our moment where we actually gotta like go in. And all you other signs that be hating, just hate from the outside. Hate from outside of the club because you guys, because y'all can't even get in. I know it must be so exhausting trying to be a Leo, but if you weren't born into it, you really just can't be it. Is that too arrogant? I'm sorry. Let me relax. <laughs> Let me relax. Alright, so next up, we're gonna go in with some reds. Basically, I'm gonna go in with the Jaclyn Hill OG palette. And I'm gonna go in with this bright red right here, and then I'm also gonna go in with this dark red on the outer corner. I don't wanna bring that dark red in too much in, but I will keep it on the outside. But the brighter red, though, I will bring it in just a little bit and all. Just to deepen this orange shade up. I'm actually really hungry. I'm like so hungry. I want to go eat. I'm actually going out to eat. It's the first day of Leo season and we're celebrating already. This is like pre my birthday, but also celebrating Leo season. Because on my birthday, we're going to go crazy. Turning 22. There ain't really much to celebrate for anything anyways. You know, when I turned 21, that was it. Like, what can you do after 21? That's so exciting. Nothing. Literally. Sad. Just getting old out here. But we're getting older and wiser. Just doing us. Alright. We got that. Next up, we're just going to go in with that dark red that I told you. I'm going to keep that in the outer corner. Just to give, give it a bit more like dimension in that color and this outer corner. Gonna be the quickest Leo warm season look because you know it's gonna, but it's also gonna be extra you know we're very simple but we're also very extra and obnoxious so it's definitely a Leo vibe simple but also extra all right Next up, we we'll kind of want to clean the inner corners because I got some shadow in there. So I'm going to reach behind me real quick and grab some makeup remover. And clean that up a bit. Yeah, it's going to fall out too. Was Gucci. Next up, we're gonna do the lower lash line, smoke that up a bit too. I'm gonna go in with an M149. I'm basically the same colors that I went with the up here. I'm gonna go in with my bottom. I'm gonna go into with my bottom lash line. I'm gonna start off with that brownish color right here. I'm gonna go in with that. I'm 
And then I'm also going to go in with... No, actually, I'm going to go in with the reds first. Those two reds that I used up top here, the light and dark ones. And that dark one, I'm going to keep it on the outside mainly. I go right there. Yep. Just like that. And I'm thinking for the orange, I'm going to go back and feeling myself. I'm going to put that like to bring those colors up even more. To bring that and put that all over my lower lash line. You guys know how much I hate with my lower lash line. Like literally, I just don't like it at all. Okay. Now we're gonna go in with uh, M504 and just blend this lower lash line up a bit more. So it's going to be even more smoky here. Like that. There we go. So eyes right now are done. Well, actually, no. I'm thinking. So instead of doing an inner corner highlight, I definitely want... We put some glitter, so I'm gonna go in with a heavy metal glitter, and I'm gonna go in, from by Arindicate. I'm gonna go in with gold mine because gold, whether you guys believe it or not, Leos, we love gold. Every Leo I've ever crossed paths with, male or female or whatever, they always have some type of gold on, whether it be like gold earrings, gold necklaces, gold bracelets, gold rings, or even their makeup, they have something that's some type of like gold and like bronzy and warm tone so i'm gonna go in i'm gonna put this on my bottom bottom lash line like right there in the inner corner just to give that look a little extra something you know like i told you us leos we're extra but we're very simple too we're like a mixture of both like the best of both worlds you want the best of both worlds get yourself a leo Literally, as I said that, one of my good friends, who is also a Leo, just texted me. Oh. She was she just texted me and she was like, are you filming that Leo look yet? And I'm like, I must have texted her back and be like, yep. And just like that. A little gold. You never hurt the soul. And while I'm at it, I'm going to do my brows. Yeah. I was thinking whether I should do my skin first or my brows. I'm just literally doing everything backwards. Like, I literally don't do my makeup for, like, two, three weeks. Don't film for two, three weeks. Then I come back and I don't know how to act anymore. Everything's just completely out of order. <laughs> so I'm going to go in with the Brow Wiz in the shade Medium Brown. And I'm going to start with off with this to outline my brows. So after we're done with the pencil, the brows, we're going to go in with powder just to enhance them up a bit more. Don't want anything too crazy with my brows, but just enhance them up a little bit more. I'm going to go with the powder dark brown duo, and I'm going to go in with the lighter shade, this shade right here. brows right now are looking on fleek I'm vibing with them you know next up we're going to do our skin so I'm going to contour but it's going to be very lightly but I'm more so going to bronze today so I'm going to go in with my Chanel bronzer and where's my brush that wild ass that wild little brush okay so we're done with the brows at the moment I think I'm going to be done with them 
for the day. But we're gonna contour and bronze today. So we're basically gonna bronze tour. We're gonna bronze today. We're gonna go into my Chanel bronzer using the M439 after I cleaned it off. I don't know what that yellow eyeshadow was doing on there to begin with. Cause I, I don't know. I have no idea. So we're gonna go in there. And we're gonna start bronzer, bronzering. We're gonna start bronzing very lightly. bronzering and now we're just gonna go in and we're going to contour up just a little if I can find my contour brush right here which is the M530 going with Brontour by Morphe this palette right here the duo we're gonna go in very lightly with the contour because we don't want it to be too contour but we want enough contour where it's shaping our face but we don't want too much dramatic I'm gonna take a small, same brush, M504. Just go over my nose a little bit. Give it a little bit of warmth. Like that. And we're gonna go in and clean up just a little bit using concealer by Fenty in the shade Bamboo. I'm gonna put some on the nose. Center forehead. Um, right there. Just cleaning up those areas. Get in, we'll get in there. Next up, we're gonna blush it up. So today's blush, we're gonna give it like a very like pinkish nude brush, blush if you know what I mean. So we're gonna go in with the Morphe 8C palette and we're gonna go in with the color It Girl. And it's basically just like this pinkish, like very cool pinkish nude kind of pink. Well, at least to me it is and I like it. Cause it just like gives me that subtle blush look without being too much. I'm gonna put on my apples on my cheeks. And then I'm gonna blend it up on my upward on my cheeks, to my cheekbones. I'm gonna blend really, really good. Cause I want it to blend with the bronzer. Put some a little on my nose, just the leftovers, and even bring it down to my cheek right here. Blush it all up. I put some a little bit on my forehead. Just whatever is remaining on the brush, I just go over my face, really. And then we're gonna highlight. So I don't know how crazy we're gonna go with the highlight. I don't want to get too crazy. I really want to keep it like nice and simple. But I'm gonna go in with a gold highlight. I'm gonna go in with Vegas by Anastasia. It's the loose powder. Nothing too crazy. But I'm thinking. So let me get up some Max Fix Plus first. But I am thinking that. I want to highlight a bit more different. I want to highlight up on my cheekbones instead of the apples on my cheek because I kind of just want that like 
kind of wanted to be extra a little bit on Leo season, the first day of Leo season. So we're gonna go in. It's gonna be like, I don't know, we're just gonna go with the flow and see how it turns out. Usually I'm not too crazy about the high cheekbone highlight, but I'm kind of liking this. This is actually really nice and subtle. Not subtle, but it's like, subtle, but it's like in your face. Do the other side. Put some on my cupid's bow, chin, even do some on like nose right there, on the forehead, on the chin. All right, so we're gonna go in with Max Fix Plus and we're just gonna set everything real quick and like blend everything in, do a couple sprays. We're gonna go in with the M439 brush and just push everything in. I might go back in just a little bit with some a little bit more highlight and just go over this. Make it come out even more. Like that. Just go over all those places. Bam, more highlighted. Also gonna go in with just a little bit for my brow highlight. Brush these up the way I want them. And take a little bit using the M213 brush. Not too much and just highlight that brow bone. Bam. Brows are done. Skin is done. Next up is going to basically be mascara. I'll put some mascara on. I think I'm going to do mascara off camera and I'll come back. Because who wants to see me put on mascara? Nobody. Okay, guys. Mascara is complete next up we got left is literally just the lip so the lip i'm thinking i'm going to do a bold red lip i'm going to go in with a couple lip liners i'm going to first go off with me start off with mina by morphe this red right here i'm just like going crazy today you know And then next up, we're gonna go in with Scarlet and put that on the outside. Not outside, but basically go over the outside more so ever. Red lip that I'm gonna go in with is Dominant, right? To dominate. Dominate. And we're gonna go in with that.
and I might even go just a bit with uh, Morphe as well. I'm like, when it comes to my reds, I'm like literally all over the place with them. I like to mix so many reds to get the red that I want. And then I'm gonna go in and clean it up. Cause this bottom lip is kinda looking weird. So, there we have it, you guys. This is my Leo season bold look. We are just like bold with the red lips, nice smoky orange red eye. We got gold highlight glitter. Y'all know, y'all watched it. Y'all know what's happening in this video. I don't need to repeat myself and everything. All together, happy Leo season to my fellow Leos and happy birthday to all my Leos as well well i hope you guys celebrate given the fact that we are still in the pandemic make sure you stay safe and you keep those who are celebrating with you surrounded as well safe other than that to all my other signs you're sh it's not your time to shine no more literally just know your place because the kings and queens are out to play now you know we're we're ready you guys are just standing on the sideline and we're running down the field going crazy no i'm just joking i'm just joking don't go crazy also there will definitely be an instagram post so if you definitely want to see that leo season instagram post don't forget to hit that follow button on instagram i'm gonna put my instagram down below and it's also gonna pop up on the screen it should be popping up one side what one of these sides it should be popping up my insta <laughs> but other than that i hope to see you guys on my next video Mwah.